Hello, Dunky. Since I released my Guide to Girl videos two months back, I have become the fourth right authority in League of Legends Women because the actual Guide to Girls is to make the video Guide to Girls on YouTube by Dunky. Which is me. By now, I think I've talked to and played with about 150 actual girls on League, all of which added me, which lets you know right off the bat that they have some major issues and that I am pretty pathetic to actually sort through these and look for girls. Alright, and now for Act 2 of Guide to Stupid Bimbos. In the first one, I showed you how to find some women on League, but finding them is only Phase 1 of four phases. Herding on women. Alright, you can't just be going in there with your dick in your hands. You gotta be prepared for these situations with some of the top dialogue from top men. Hey baby, you got a kid? Cause you look like, ooh my ma! Hey baby, you got parking? Cause I wanna park my car! YOU BITCH! Just by using these subtle, delicate gentleman lines in dialogue with a woman, you're already ahead of the pack. What I wanna stress first and foremost though, are the varieties of women you will encounter. Just like Pokemon, you got different classes with different weaknesses, Bugatti bitches. Now you gotta watch out for these ones. It starts off innocent enough, but boom, just out of nowhere, you're in a room with a pack of goons. One woman to three guys, and now you're the fourth. And then you get into Skype and they're all in love with her and won't shut the fuck up talking to her. And in that situation, you just gotta go, you know what? This is Bugatti bitches. I'm getting the fuck out of here, dumb bitches. These ones are fucking dumb. <laughs> Don't add her. Mouse bitches. These ones are almost too abundant on League. They have really squeaky voices and can be very nice to you in short bursts, but be more than wary of mouse bitches. At their core, they are cold, manipulative, and evil. They also evolve into Blastoise. Boyfriend bitches. These women are very agreeable, nice, and just an overall joy to be around, which is why they have a boyfriend or a husband or some weirdo thing that places them in the dead zone. Out of all the classes that I've listed, this is the one that you should actually make friends with. But sometimes, you just gotta lash out on them, you know what I'm saying? So what did we learn? I have learned that the dream girl who's funny and sexy and lonely does not play League of Legends, or any video game for that matter. And if she does, she will never give a rat's ass about me. And that I should just go off and die alone in a corner. Because I don't need Blastoise. I already have Gyarados as my water guy.